All right, guys. Well, let's take a minute and talk about uh, developing balance and body awareness and overall strength in our dogs. You know, I tell you, in the last few years, uh, it's just been crazy with how many times I've heard, uh, you know, oh, you don't want to let your dog exercise. You want to wait till they're a year old to let them go up and down the steps and whatever. And uh, that's just nonsense. Uh, I mean, that has about as much validity to it as, uh, you know, not letting your kid uh, play soccer until he's an adult. Well, of course, if you wait till your kid's an adult to play soccer, they're not going to be very good at it, okay? So here at uh, Cabin Creek Kennel, you know, what we do is we strive to take our puppies and, and the puppies that come here to stay with us, and we teach them to have good proprioception from an early age. We want them to understand how to use their bodies on a conscious as well as subconscious level. You know, um, you just can't teach older dogs new tricks when it comes to physicality. you got to get to them young. And so we put them all through a series of exercises. Now, this is starting at 8, 9, 10 weeks old. Of course, while we're, when they're young, we, we do low-impact things, and we don't do tons of repetition, but we do it until they start to get tired. And then as they get older, we put them under a little bit more physical stress. You know, we follow the same basic format that you follow in sports for kids. Okay, so get out there and... Get in your backyard and rig you up some obstacles like what I've done here or go to your local park and find some trees down, some creeks to cross, you know, get in the bed of your truck. Get on some picnic tables or on a children's playground if you have to. But believe me, if you get your dogs out and you exercise them and you develop good body awareness, it's going to have benefits that pay off that dog's whole life. Uh, I guarantee you, you won't be sorry that you taught that dog to use his body at an early age.